guys and welcome to my video. My name is Mars Andre and today I'll share from section B and 2 and today I have a special treat for you as we dive into the vibrant world of the National Museum of Fine Arts in the Philippines. Join me as we uncover the wonders of this cultural heaven and explore one of its most iconic masterpieces, Juan Luna's Timeless Spolario. Now let's get started. I'm here at the National Museum of Fine Arts, previously known as the Legislative Building, a historically significant monument located on Padre Burgos Street in the Philippines. It was initially designed by Ralph Harrington Duan, Antonio Manalac Toledo, and Juan M. Arellano as the National Library between 1918 to 1926, but was later repurposed as the Legislative Building with added features like a fourth floor and chambers for legislators. During World War II, Japanese forces used the building as a stronghold and it suffered heavy damage from American bombardment. Reconstructed in 1949, the building retained its original footprint and four-story height, albeit with a less elaborate facade. The building has a rectangular layout with symmetrical courtyards, flanked by hallways and staircases. Its exterior is characterized by giant Corinthian columns and decorative entablatures with east and west facades, largely identical apart from a few details. The National Museum of Fine Art now houses 29 galleries with works from 19th century Filipino masters, national artists, and leading modern artists. It also includes administrative offices, public places, and outdoor sculptures. The building stands as a tribute to the nation's history and showcases one of its cultural heritage. Before we explore this polarium, let's take a moment to appreciate the diverse range of art on display. Here, we have the works of Fernando Amorsolo, the renowned Filipino painter known for his vivid landscapes and captivating portraits. His painting beautifully depicts senses of rural life, capturing the essence of Filipino identity and heritage. The National Museum of Fine Arts also boasts an impressive collection of contemporary Filipino art, featuring innovative and thought-provoking works that reflect the complexities of our modern society. It's truly remarkable to see how Filipino artists contain to push boundaries and redefine the art scene of the Philippines. Here are only some of the examples of the works these Filipino artists have made. Now, let's turn attention to the crown jewel of this museum, the Spolarium. Spolarium is one of the most important artworks in Philippine history, created by Juan Luna. It depicts the somber scene of fallen gladiators being dragged into the Roman arena's depths. It symbolizes the collective struggle and resilience of the Filipino people during the Spanish colonial period. 
Dr. Jose Rizal viewed the painting as a reflection of spirit of our social, moral, and spiritual life. Humanity subjected to trials unredeemed, risen in open fight with prejudice, fantasism, and injustice. Attention to detail for deeper understanding at the center of Luna's painting are fallen gladiators being dragged by Roman soldiers. On the left, spectators await their chance to strip off the combatants of their metal helmets and other armory. In contrast with the charged emotions featured on the left, the right side meanwhile represents a somber mood. An old man carries a torch, perhaps searching for his son, while a woman weeps the death of her loved one. Spolarium is a direct translation for the Roman Colosseum's basement where bodies of dead gladiators are taken off and stripped of their armor. What the Spolarium symbolizes is the symbolism of the Filipino people's ignorance, blindness, mental darkness, and oppression. Now that we have a deeper understanding of the Spolarium and the remarkable artworks within the National Museum of Fine Arts, I urge each and every one of you to visit the National Museum and witness these iconic artworks firsthand. The experience of standing in front of these immense canvases is genuinely breathtaking and can leave a lasting impact on your appreciation for art.